Oof. Oof. So, um, Ravens, where were y'all? Did, 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 were y'all sitting on cloud nine thinking you were going to take the easy way out to the AFC championship? Did you, did you think that? It didn't happen. It did not happen at all, man. Let me tell you. Um, so the Ravens basically had three weeks off and just looked awful in this game. The Titans are going to the AFC Championship as a sixth seed. This is crazy. This is a crazy time we are living in right now. When Ryan Tannehill is going to the AFC Championship. What is this? What is this season? It's, it, it's magical. That's what it is. Um, Derrick Henry just ran all over the Titans. Well, for the Titans, not... He didn't run all over the Titans, but he ran all over the Ravens, though. And the final was 2012. Um, really, it was a garbage time touchdown by the Ravens at the very end of the game. But, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is, man. Just... Man, I mean, what can you, what can you, what else can you say when when somebody goes off like this? Like, shoot, Derrick Henry had at least 170 rushing yards in that game, but the Ravens also had a bunch of miscues, like six drop passes, one pass drop from Mark Andrews that ended up being intercepted by either Kevin Byer. Yeah, it was Kevin Byard who intercepted one. Bacaro intercepted another one from Lamar Jackson where he was just throwing it, just throwing it. And Lamar threw it like 50 times this game, which isn't the ideal for, you know, the Ravens because they're a run-oriented team. Um, and when Ryan Tannehill needed to make a play, he made a play. Couple of beautiful throws that ended up into some beautiful touchdowns, a jump pass from Derrick Henry as well, you know. And I mean, it, it just is what it is, man. Like, and Lamar Jackson also got fumbled, hey, got strip sacked, you know. He was just looking, did not look like the Lamar Jackson of this past regular season that was doing amazing things. Like, I mean, he still had some great plays, but, you know, um, ultimately, at the very end, a couple of good, flashy plays doesn't mean anything when your whole team looks terrible. I mean, come on now, Brandon Carr getting bossed again? <laughs> We've seen that before. Dude, it's garbage. That's why we let go of him. As a Cowboys fan. You know, we think that guy's garbage, but you know, it is what it is. Um, so, Titans could be facing Kansas City or Houston tomorrow. It just depends on what in the world is going to happen in that game. So, you know, I'm excited to see this Titans defense take on whoever they're going to face. You know. And, and this offense that can run the ball, and when they need to throw, they throw it effectively. Um, don't don't feel down, Ravens. You got you got a lot to hang your hat on. You had a great season, just couldn't get it done this time. You can try next year though. So you got 2020, 2020 season to look forward to. So you know it is what it is. Um, and so with that, that concludes our Saturday of Triple Header Video Saturday um, for you all. Um, nothing else really happened in college basketball that needs to be warranted of talking about, as far as I know. Um, so, and nothing else really happened in NBA stuff either. And the NBA is really not going to become a concern to me until next week. So... Look out for some NBA videos this week. Um, but with that being said, uh, take care tonight. Let's rest up and get ready.
for tomorrow because we got a triple header video tomorrow as well. So y'all take care and we'll see you guys tomorrow.